How's it going guys? This is Eric with the Range Survival and today I'm going to issue a challenge and uh, the challenge is going to be called the Range Survival Shelter Challenge and we'll probably put uh, DS Shelter Challenge for short and just put that in the title this way I can find the video or if you want to send me a private message and send me the video link would be greatly appreciated. So what are the rules? The rules are you have to construct a shelter in under five minutes. Now say you're hiking along the trail and all of a sudden the weather turns and starts a torrential downpour. The reason I want to create this challenge is to prepare people for a situation like that. Uh, it's a great way to practice your skills and see other people in their different types of setup as well. So the challenge is you have to construct a shelter in under five minutes. Uh, a couple of rules. You have to be able to sit in the shelter comfortably and not have the roof touch your head. So basically enough room to, to sit in it comfortably. The shelter has to cover at least two sides to protect you from the wind. I think that's about it. So I'm going to do the challenge right now. Uh, if I come up with some other rules that I don't mention in the video, check out the description below. It'll have all the rules for you guys to check out. So let me set up the camera and let's do the challenge. Timer doesn't start until you open your package that your shelter is in. Start the timer right now. And at this point, I can either stick it down to the ground instead. Kind of off frame here. Done. Four minutes, 34 seconds. Ha! Four minutes, 34 seconds. So I have my shelter set up here. Nine by nine DD top. Ridge line in between two trees, press a knot on that side, press a knot on this side. Just tied this one off to this tree here to give me a nice entrance way. It's a quick, easy shelter to set up, under five minutes. If I really wanted to, I can reinforce these stakes or tie uh, the bottom corners here off to another tree to really reinforce it. And this will definitely keep me out of the rain. If it happens to rain or downpour, I could sit here for a little bit, relax. Maybe have a little fire in the front, dry off. And that's the reason I want to make this challenge. So anybody can do the challenge. Uh, if you want to do the challenge, uh, just put Deranged Survival Shelter Challenge in the title or DS Shelter Challenge, just so I can find you easily. And uh, yeah, tag three people at the end of the video. So the challenge continues. It's a great way to uh, practice your shelter building, skill, shelter building skills and also to see other people's shelters as well to give you ideas and faster tips and tricks to make it easier. Usually what I do when I put this tarp away, I leave all the, the lines on each corner. I tie the pressic knots onto the loops here where they belong. This way when I pull the hammock out or when I pull the tarp out, everything's available. And then I keep the ridge line right on top so it's right, ready, ready to go <laughs> ready ready to go so that's all i got that's my challenge please share this video with others give me a thumbs up really lets me know that you guys like what i'm doing and uh that's all i got i'll see you in the next one yeah